Alliance Francaise French Cultural Center was the venue where 100 photographs of Sin's wild birds were exposed. This was the second such exhibition of snaps taken by Mirza Naeem Beg and members of his group called Dream Merchants. Speaking on the occasion, Mirza Naeem Beg said, that uh, I have come to this stage where uh, me and my friends together, the group I have created called the Wildlife with Dream Merchants, we have now from an A50 birds uh, one and a half years back, we are now about 270 birds of synth recorded. These birds um, were never ever recorded before. Uh, I don't think our wildlife department or WWF has uh, this record. And the exciting part, as you see, there's so many people here, mashallah, uh, is because the more people get aware of these birds, the more our message goes across. For example, I have now in my page about 1,500 people, so 1,500 families are aware of these beauties. We have the threats, we have the threat of poaching, we have the threat of netting, we have the threat of hunting, and to top that all, the state development, we are taking away all the habitat, beautiful habitat, and they are run, running away. Uh, these flamingos live around uh, mangroves, and as you know, we are losing mangroves so fast. These mangroves have these creeks where you find those shrimps, small shrimps, and that's their favorite meal. Once they eat that, they get that pink color. And that's why many people call it pink flamingos. Now, in this area around only, I have seen in three years, half the mangroves have gone. The industries have come up, there's contamination. And I can notice in three years, three years back, I recorded about 300 uh, flamingos. They've come down to about 100 or so. So we've got to protect them. And this is my mission. These exhibitions are a part of that. You just have to show your desire to join us. The, the page is called Wildlife with Dream Merchants. And uh, I announce trips uh, once or twice a month. And then we target a certain bird or a certain area and we, are, we celebrate if somebody catches a new species. So all you have to do is to join the page. You'll be updated once you join what's happening, what we are doing, and we move forward. That's very simple, really. In the last three years, I have taken trips along with 20 people, 25 people, 10 people, about 70 trips from Tharpakar, Nagarpakar, Larkana, Tanuma Matkan, and Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Touchwood security has improved far better, and we have never been disturbed or threatened as far as security is concerned. not have any sponsors yet. These pictures are for sale. Whatever you know, money we get out of it, we put back in our trips and you know try to try to cover maximum areas. Startup level is uh, actually a 300 mm lens which is uh, very basic. Uh, 
ideally what we are carrying now is 500 mm, 600 mm. Um, I wouldn't like to name brands, but normally the two top are Canon and uh, Nikon. It's not easy to do wildlife photography with a mobile because uh, you see it's the most challenging photography because you have no control on light, you have no control on the pose of the subject, you have no control on the background. So it, it is very heavy hard work carrying heavy lenses, sitting in a place, we wear camouflage, camouflage hats, camouflage you know, coats so that we are not seen. We had those big lenses, but you can't take a picture of a bird sitting you know, in the car window. So we used a mobile to take that picture.